Today we've come here with the uh, uh, chairman and the board of uh, Lake Victoria North to commission a water project that they were undertaking in Moy Girls High School. That's a, program, a project that's under the Kenya Schools uh, program. And uh, we've uh, seen the project, it is well done. I want to commend the, uh, the board and the management of uh, Lake Victoria North for the good work that they have, they have done in this project. So as a county, we want to thank Lake Victoria for this good work. The school will now benefit from the uh, rainy water harvesting. There is a, a, a big tank that we have seen, which will carry 225 uh, um, cubic meters uh, of water. Uh, apart from uh, what we have seen today, the county government of Wasingishu has embarked in uh, water harvesting and we are doing quite a number of dams. Some are new, others we are desilting uh, because we know Wasingishu is endowed with uh, quite a number of dams, uh, especially since during the colonial time. And uh, since then the dams have a lot of silt, so we are doing uh, desilting. And uh, we are also working on some uh, water pans so that our residents can get enough water. We are also doing a lot of drilling, especially in schools, uh, health centers, and uh, communities where we have community land. So we have what we call community water projects. As an agency, we came here today to commission the project because one, it was part of our performance contract for the last financial year. Then two, we also wanted to see whether there was value for money. And we are satisfied with the good work that has been done with the management. Where we only urge and request the CEC who is here representing the governor that now that water is at world function and we are aware that a little town has cast of water. If it to come in as a government and do other maybe two or three masonry water tanks so that we can harvest the water, uh, then uh, you realize that this is a guard school and girls really need water. So I want to believe if the county government can chip in and do two more tanks, then uh, Moy High School uh, Highlands, with a population of about 2,000 people, will do, uh, water scarcity will be a thing of the past. Uh, there is a seamless uh, handing over. We're happy with the progress. We've been uh, handed over 70% of the projects, and we've agreed with uh, my fellow chairman and directors of Lake Victoria that the next, uh, the other 30% of the projects remaining with them, we will be going around to assess them. As we are, uh, they hand over, we assess and see if there was value for money. And uh, for the other projects that uh, they're still uh, under them, uh, there is one which is uh, under Kenya Towns. We have Keep Current Dam. We have uh, two, I mean, uh, two rivers dam consultancy. And we have uh, a last mile sewerage project that is uh, being undertake, undertaken in the Lorette. Uh, because they are uh, uh, the engineers now, uh, there's an uh, addendum or subsidiary agreement uh, on the part of the three agencies, that is uh, Central Rift, uh, North Rift and uh, Lake Victoria North, so that we can uh, take over as engineers and the beneficiary agency of those pro uh, projects. Uh, we, we also have um, other uh, projects that are being done by the national government through our agencies, especially um, uh, the Two Rivers Dam. We also have Kipkaren Dam, uh, which is ongoing now. Uh, so we want to say that Wasin Gishu uh, is doing quite well in terms of uh, uh, harvesting water, rain water, and also uh, running water. We have quite a number of, of dams. Just to cite a few, we have uh, one at um, Sasitwa Dam. Uh, we have uh, Chelabal. We have um, one in uh, Tarbo. And we are also going to embark on two, one from uh, Kapseret and the other one from um, uh, uh, Kaptagat Ward. Therefore, we want to say that we are working to see that the people of Singishu have water. Tuko na population ya tu, about 2,000 within this community. Maji tumekua tukitenekemea ya nawasko. 
uh, wasichana wanatumia maji mingi sana na tumekuwa na hiyo rationing kwa hivyo tumekuwa na shida kiasi ya maji wa, uh, uh, especially wakati wa kiangazi huwa tunanunua maji um, so uh, ku harvest hiyo maji kuokota maji na ku pump kwa system yetu itatusaidia sana kwa sababu Eldoret ni mahali ambapo kuna mvua wakati mwingi so hiyo itakuwa imetusaidia sana na tutakuwa na shida hatuitarajii kuwa na shida tena ya maji